Well, I'm going to share a little bit about hiring massage therapists and estheticians for small business. Throughout the years, as you hire and as people leave or you even have to fire some people, you have to keep hiring new ones. And the way that we retain and attract most of the talent is through a couple things. So first is reputation. So good reviews for business is not just important for customers. Potential employees also read reviews about business. That is general reviews from consumers. That also might be business reviews on posting boards, referrals from other employees. So reputation as being a quality place that customers love to come is one way to attract quality talent. The other way to attract quality talent, of course, you gotta keep advertising your job openings. Don't expect people just to show up. And then also the compensation, it has to be competitive and it has to be at least the same or more of similar leading quality employment places. Because if it's too low, I mean, you might attract some talent, but they're going to be more prone to leave when they get really good to higher paying opportunities. They might not be willing to, you know, go the extra mile. Of course, as always, you know, you got to still make business as a money. You got taxes, you got buildings, you got supplies, you got cleaning, you got uh, advertising, all these costs. It's a lot. And employees oftentimes don't understand how high those costs are and that, you know, your bottom line is only like 20% if that is, is actually good. But you know, if you pay them 45% commission, they think, oh, well, the business is getting like, you know, 55. No, because you're still paying portion of their half of their tax. And like I said, supplies, building, advertising. Advertising is one of the big costs besides taxes. And then location, like whether it be business mortgage or rent cost, lease costs. But regardless, you gotta set up your business in a way that you're able to pay your people of the same or above industry rates. For example, so at Brilliant Massages, can we, I created a system that I'm able to do that because we have help from virtual receptionists and then we train our therapists certain tasks so that way we're able to pay them a very competitive rate and not burn them out doing way too many massages a day. We have you know, pretty flexible time off policy where we approve a lot of like vacation time. They're not paid vacations, you know, but they are full straight commission employees with bonuses that they get as well. So those are the main important things. It's really your business reputation. Is there other quality people working there? Because top performers, they want to work with other top performers, with other people that are good. Because if you hire someone that's like collecting bad feedback, bad reviews, they're gonna make business look bad and then make other people look bad that work in that business. So you have to take swift action if that happens and let those people go because they're gonna ruin reputation. They can drown the whole business or if there's too much drama going on. So you have to keep the work dynamics culture really clean of any negativity and keep the quality and feedback from customers address any complaints in a prompt manner and you know it's going to attract customers and it's going to attract employees and keep competitive pay keep competitive prices so that's why we have memberships so i know it's like a catch 22 you pay more but also have lower prices for consumers it's hard right but that's where those systems come in so whether you running your own business, your own practice, keep those things in mind. Or if you're interested to work with brands like us that offer coaching through franchising and help you set up and start your own spot, get in touch with us. I'm actually gonna be offering about once a month weekly webinar with free business Q&A, no strings attached. You don't have to buy anything. You don't have to pay anything. I just wanna share this because I've learned all, all these things throughout the years. And then if you do wanna invest in our franchise open a uh, location of your own for brilliant massage and skin that's a plus you know that's a bonus for us that we get from these webinars but it's not only for people that want to potentially invest into brilliant massage and skin it's for everyone that's in the spa world in the spa business and want to connect with like if people that are interested in into this business welcome to join so i have a page on our website joliedabrilliant.com with it's actually with a j but you say Jolita brilliant but i'm just saying Jolita brilliant because it's easier to to type that in joliedabrilliant.com slash start and i will see you then get on the email list and we'll send you out when that webinar comes out okay have a brilliant day thank you for watching